The Land Transportation Office has set a cap on driving school fees in response to complaints of expensive rates. Starting April 15, private driving schools can only charge up to 1,000 pesos for theoretical driving courses and up to 4,000 pesos for practical courses. As we hear the full report from Karen Villanda. Joed decided to learn how to drive a motorcycle and get a Land Rover driver's license to fetch his sister and ride a motorcycle going to work. That's why even the rate of driving school is costly, he spent money just to get a license. Luckily, the driving school he chose was in a promo. So instead of paying 4,500 pesos, he only paid 2,700 pesos. Masyado mabigat para sa ano. Kasi mga, nagtanong rin kasi ako sa dati kong mga ano makakakilala na mga ano, nasa 2K lang nagastos nila sa Nantro. Mga ano pa yun, matagal ng panahon yun. But starting April 15, a new maximum rate for driving schools will be implemented by the Land Transportation Office. This is more than 50% cheaper than the current rate of the other driving schools that require students to pay up to 20,000 pesos. Under the maximum rate of LTO, the theoretical driving course for four-wheel or light vehicle only costs 1,000 pesos, while the practical driving course is worth only only 4,000 pesos and only 2,000 pesos for motorcycle. LTO explained that it is time for the driving schools to lower their rates because the number of their students are now normal. No pandemia po kasi, ang pwede lang pong allowed na estudyante po ng isang driving school ay uh, 50% po. Uh, yung isang kwarto po natin kasi ay naglalaman po ng 40 estudyante. Pero nung panahon po ng pandemia ay 20 estudyante lamang po. So ngayon open na po, eh pwede na po yung 40 na sudyante. But the driving schools admitted that the cap on fees has a huge impact on their operations. Unang-una, uh, gasolina. Nag-start ako pumasok kung magkaroon ng driving school 3 years ago. Uh, kung na, uh, natatandaan ko, ang gasolina lang nun is 35 pesos yata o hindi, sabi natin 40 pesos. E ngayon magkano na? Isang delikado dyan yung road safety na pinopromote ni LTO. Anong bibili namin mga pyesa sa mga maintenance ng mga sasakyan namin? Natural, puro mga mura. Hence, the group of driving schools in the country is set to file an appeal to the LTO. And the LTO said they are open to any recommendation and complaints. We welcome all comments, suggestions, and appeals. Kung sa tingin po nung driving school ay uh, ito pong fees na to is uh, unreasonable on their part, we are more than willing to sit down with them and uh, rediscuss kung ano po yung... Uh, cost structure to come up with this uh, maximum fee. Karen Villanta for the nation.